Philippine and United States start joint maritime air patrols in West Philippine Sea. Manila, Philippines, President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. announced that the Philippines and the United States US, on Tuesday began joint maritime and air patrols in the West Philippine Sea, a part of the South China Sea which Beijing claims. Today marks the beginning of Joint Maritime and Air Patrols, a collaborative effort between the Armed Forces of the Philippines AFP, and the United States Indo-Pacific Command in the West Philippine Sea, Marco said in a statement posted on his social media on Tuesday. The President said this, significant initiative, is a testament to our commitment to bolster the interoperability of our military forces in conducting maritime and air patrols. Through collaborative efforts, we aim to enhance regional security and foster a seamless partnership with the United States in safeguarding our shared interests, he said. Marcos said the joint patrols are part of a series of events agreed upon by the Mutual Defense Board Security Engagement Board MDBCEP, of both nations. I am confident that this collaboration will contribute to a more secure and stable environment for our people, the president said. The Joint Maritime and Air Patrols are scheduled to continue until November 23, 2023, he added. Three Philippine Navy vessels BRP Conrado Yap, BRP Jose Rizal and BRP Gregorio del Pilar and three Philippine Air Force planes to FA-50PH jet fighters, one Hermes Sham Naraang drone and A-29B Super Toscano Light Combat plane will participate in the exercises, said Paul Sertzis Trinidad, Public Affairs Chief of the AFP. For its part, the U.S. will deploy an independence-class littoral combat ship USS Gabriel Giffords, a sophisticated warship in the U.S. Navy and A-58A Poseidon Intelligence, Surveillance and Reconnaissance Aircraft. The U.S.-Philippines route for the Joint Maritime Patrol starts at the northern tip of Batanes toward the West Philippine Sea.